Hi guys, welcome back to our weekly training videos. I hope you are enjoying these. Are you a person who is stuck in quarantine? Who isn't stuck in quarantine? While we are dealing with this coronavirus. So I know it's been hard for everyone. It's been hard for me. Like it's a big adjustment, but I am glad that I am able to offer this for you. For all of you dancers who are trying to continue to train, um, but having to do it at home by yourself because the studios are closed. So here we are giving it to you. So today I have three freestyle drills. Um, they are very simple. I don't, I'm not going to demonstrate them for you like I normally do because they are very self-explanatory, but, um, it is up to you to train these. This, this week's freestyle drill, I'm not going to lie. It's a little weird and it takes some time to get used to. So, Enough of me talking about it, let's get right into it. This week we are focusing on facials. Now facials for some dancers come really easy and sometimes it's really awkward for them and then it doesn't come so easy. So whatever it is for you, make sure, you know, we get through it and you work hard on this drill because it is very important. Well, number one, I'm not gonna lie, this one's a little, it could take some time to get used to. You are going to look in the mirror, play your favorite song, and you are gonna make different facials. So you might smile, you might look scared, you might look shy, whatever it is. Um, play the part, sometimes it's easier if you play the part of what the song is talking about. But this is a great drill so you don't have to focus on your movement, you're only focusing on your beautiful face. Okay, so that's drill number one. For drill number two, you are gonna take what you were working on uh, in the mirror, and you are now going to add that to music. So again, pick your favorite song, pick a different song, but try to pick a song that has emotion in it so it's a little bit easier for you to connect. And then take that with your movement and put them together. So you might do a freestyle drill, being happy and excited to be dancing. And then you might do another freestyle drill that is sad. So then you bring the emotion down and it's hard for me to be sad and explain to you this dance, but um, you get it. So pick whatever emotion the song is explaining to you and that is how you apply it to your movement. Now again, if it feels super weird and your first time going through this, it feels silly, don't worry, that's normal. Uh, the more you do it, the easier it gets. And tip number three is actually a game. So on a piece of paper, I have them written out already so you can see, I just ripped up sheets of paper and I have emotions on it. So this one is sad, happy, passionate, laughing, um, whoops, angry, you know, all the things, excited. So you put these, you fold them up, okay? And then you put it in a hat. And you can have a family member play this with you um, or a brother, or sister, whatever. I mean, that's a family member. Okay, that's awkward. You know what I mean? Fold it into a hat and then they draw out the emotion. So say I drew this one out. This says sad. And so I would have to dance for a whole song being sad. Okay, easy. Um, another game that you can play is you can dance and just freestyle and then the person who is playing the game with you, they can just yell out while you're dancing, be sad, be happy, be excited. And then that gives um, you a moment to stand like on your, or stay on your toes like, and have to pay attention. So if you're dancing and you're like, oh, I have to be happy and then all of a sudden, sad and then excited and so on and so forth. Hope those freestyle drills help you. There are three of them to work on your facials. I'm very excited again to be able to bring this to you. If you have any questions, let me know. Um, and yeah, so if you're practicing these trainings, I would love for you to tag me and then uh, let me see and then I can give you specific criticism for your movement or not criticism, I should say advice for your movement and how I can help you. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day and I will see you next week.